So this is our example number one for chapter three, torsion in or torsion of thin walled tubes. So a steel tube with a cross section shown carries a torque T. The tube is six feet long and has a constant wall thickness of three eight inch. Number one, compute the torsional stiffness. K is equal to T over theta of the tube. If the tube is twisted through 0.5 degrees, determine the shear stress in the wall of the tube. Use G is equal to, is equal to 12 times 10 raised to 6 PSI and neglect the stress concentration at the corner. So, we assume the, natin na, ano, na wala daw siyang ano, shear con, uh, stress concentration dito sa mga corners niya. Okay? Ayan, so observe natin yung ano, figure. Yung ating ano, thickness is constant sa buong ano, sides ng ating tube. So, lahat sila 3.8 inch. So, yung ating mga sukat na to is 6 inches, 5 inches, and 4 inches. Nasa gitna yan. So, yung sabihin, nasa median line. Okay? So, number one, ano daw, uh, yung stiffness natin, torsional stiffness. So, yung K is equal to T over theta. Okay, so, number... So, number one, ating K is equal to t over theta. So, kailangan natin ng t and uh, theta, no? So, di ba, since constant yung ating thickness, yung ating theta is equals to t multiplied by l multiplied by s over 4 multiplied by the square of the area sub O. Okay? Multiplied by g multiplied by thickness t. Okay? Yan. So, substitute lang natin yung ating O dito, yung ating theta dito. So, yung ating stiffness K is equals to T over T multiplied by L multiplied by S over 4 multiplied by A sub O squared G multiplied by T. So, cancel yung ating T. Okay? So, yung ating stiffness K is equals to okay, tataas itong nasa mga baba. Itong mga nasa baba, tataas so, 4 multiplied by A sub O squared multiplied by G multiplied by T okay, small t over L multiplied by S. Okay, so solve natin yung A sub O natin. Okay, so yung A sub O natin is ito. So, dito sa gitna. And this is trapezoid. Okay, nasa gitna. Ayan. So, ito yung shape ng ating cross-sectional area. Ayan. Ayan. So, ito. Ayan. So, yung A sub O natin, A sub O is equals to 1 half of 6 plus 4 multiplied by the height. Ang height natin is 5 inches. So, ito yung ating A sub O. So, yung A sub O natin is 25 inch squared. Okay? Yung ating G given, yung ating T given, yung ating L is given, that is 6 feet. So, yung S na lang natin. Di ba yung ating S is sa circle, circumference? So, that is, ano, perimeter yun. So, ito yan, yung perimeter yung kukunin natin. So, yung S natin yan is equals to 6 inches plus 4 inches plus itong length na to. Okay? So, yung length natin dito is Okay, so, ano siya? Hypotenuse sa triangle na makukuha natin mula rito. Ayan. Okay, ayan. And this is equals to Okay, so, ilan ba to? This is 6 minus 4 divided by 2. Okay, so 6 minus 4 is 2 over 2 is 1 inch. And this is what? 5 inches. So, para makuha to, this is square root of, okay, so square root of 1 squared, and square root of 1 squared plus 5 squared. So, this is square root of 26. So, square root of 26. And syempre, dalawa sila. So, multiplied by 2. Ayan. So, 6 plus 4 plus 2 multiplied by square root of 26. 
So, 20.198. Okay? So, 20.198 inches. Ayan. Okay, so makukuha natin yung ating stiffness K. So, 4 multiplied by 25 is squared. So, ilan yun? Nun yun. So, inch to the fourth. Tama ba? Multiplied by G. Ang G natin is in PSI. So, pounds, no? Okay? So, 12 times 10 raised to 6 pounds per inch squared. Okay? Multiplied by thickness T. Ang ating thickness is 3 8 inch. Over. Okay? Over L. Ang L natin is 6 feet. So, convert natin into inches. Ayan. So, this is inches. Then, S natin is inches. So, 20.198 inch squared. Ah, sorry. Inch lang pala. Ayan. Okay. So, tignan natin kung ano yung magiging. So, tignan natin yung magka-cancel out. So, ito nasa baba to. So, this is inch squared. And inch squared din to. So, that is inch to the fourth. Tama ba? So, kung nasa baba yung inch to the fourth, inch to the fourth dito. So, cancel na yun. So, cancel na itong mga to. Ayan. Matitira na lang is pounds inch. And, Siyempre, ano to? Per, ano to eh? Per tita, ibig sabihin regions. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, torque over regions. Ayan. So, ito yung ating K. Or stiffness K. Torsional stiffness. 4 multiplied by 25 squared multiplied by 12 times 10 raised to 6 multiplied by 3 over 8. Ayan. Over 6 multiplied by 12 multiplied by 20.198 Yan. Okay. So, ano to eh? Uh, pounds na? So, sabihin tingnan na lang. <laughs> Gawin tingnan na. Tips. Para medyo malit na lang siya. Yan. 7735 Yan. So, 7735.914 So, 7, 7 Ano da? 135 Okay, 7735. 7735.914 keeps inch per regions. So, ito yung ating stiffness. Or torsional stiffness. Number 2. Ang pinapakuha is, ayan, if the tube is twisted through 0.5 degrees, determine the shear stress in the wall of the tube. Okay. So, syempre, meron na tayong, ano, di ba? Uh, um, torsional stiffness. So, makuha natin yung torque natin. Okay? Kasi yung torque natin, magamit natin yun dun sa, ano, sa pagkuha ng shear flow. Okay? Kasi, di ba, yung ating, ano, shear stress is equals to shear flow over T. Tama ba? So, yan. Makukuha na natin yung ating, ano, uh, shear stress kapag nakuha natin yung shear flow. Ayan yung ating shear flow is equals to T over 2A sub O. So, kunin natin yung ating T, which is equivalent to uh, torsional stiffness K multiplied by theta. So, convert natin yung theta natin. Theta is equals to 0. 0.5 degrees. Convert natin into regions. So, over 180 degrees multiplied by pi. So, 0. 0.5 multiplied by pi over 180 so 0.00873 0.00873 okay so ito yung ating ano um theta or angle of twist so makukuha natin yung t so yung t natin na torque is equals to Okay, so 7735.914 Okay, keeps inch per rad Okay, multiplied by 0 0.00873 So this is regions Yan, so obvious Magka-cancel yung Ano, magka-cancel out yung regions natin Ang matitira is keeps inch So 7735.914 so, last answer na lang. Yan. Multiplied by answer. So, 67.509. So, 67.509 
keeps H. Ayan. So, kung meron tayong T, makukuha natin yung Q natin. So, Q is equals to T na 67.509. Then, multiply na natin ng 10 raised to 3 para maging pounds inch. Ayan. Okay? Over. Ayan. So, divided by 2 multiplied by A sub O natin is 25. So, this is inch squared. So, cancelled out yung isang inch. Ang matiter dito is inch. And that is the unit of shear flow. That is what? Uh, shear force over unit uh, length. Ayan. So, per unit length. So, that is inch. Okay? So, ito yung ating Q ngayon. O yung shear flow natin. So, 67.509 multiplied by 10 raised to 3 over 2 multiplied by 25. So, 130.18. Uh, 150.18 pounds per inch. So, makuha natin yung ating shear stress. So, ating shear stress is uh, shear flow Q na 150.18 pounds per inch. So, ibaba na lang natin yun. So, ito yan. Okay. Then, multiplied by thickness. So, that is 3 over 8 inch. So, yung ating shear stress is equals to, okay, divided by 3 over 8. Ayan. So, 3,600.48. So, 3,600.48. So, pounds per square inch. So, that is PSI. Ayan. So, ito na yung ating ano, um, problem number one for torsion of thin wall tubes. So, kung napansin ninyo, dapat magsimula muna tayo sa pinapahanap talaga. That is shear stress. Okay? So, shear stress is equal to Q over T. Then, anong equation ng Q? That is T over T sa uh, T over 2 multiplied by A sub O. So, ano, saan natin makukuha yung T? From the um, stiffness or torsional stiffness. Na T is equal to K multiplied by uh, angle of twist theta. Then, convert natin yung given angle of twist theta. Then, makapwala natin yung ating shear stress. Okay? So, this is our example number one for torsion of thin walled tubes. Okay.